A question of character. character. Shun Li owns two of China's deadliest legs, ten lethal toes, and dual thighs of terror. Shun Li's name is Mandarin for spring beauty, and indeed she is pretty, pretty deadly. Shun Li is one of the fiercest combatants in the land of China. Her attack is rapid. Her hair buns are cute. Shun Li practices Chinese Kimpo. Shun Li dons a traditional Qi Pao not just to honor her late mother, but also for accurate face kicks. Along with her battle leggings, she is able to quickly attain full strike, strike, strike with each thrust, thrust, thrust. Yes, yes, yes. Outstanding. She performs the head hop as a respected Interpol officer. Shun Li has entered the Street Fighter tournament. Shun Li is set on avenging the death of her father, killed by M. Bison, while simultaneously destroying the Shadow Lu organization. Right after she destroys human face, her rivals may view her thin frame and presume that she is a mere pushover, but they are not ready for them legs. Not only are Shun Li's legs able to glow kick from here to infinity, they enable her to fly. In verse, incredible. Using the spinning bird kick technique, she transforms into a heli human. Have legs, will travel. Her outfit consists of weighted spiked training bracelets, helping to improve her martial art ability. Also, to maintain her gravity so she doesn't fly away. Instead of wearing traditional flats that would suit a dress of this nature, she wears high-heeled boxing boots laced up to lace you up. She feels the burn with her friends. The car feels the burn with her feet. Chun Li dons the thinnest and sheerest of leggings, unashamed of flashing her opponent. Oh. As well, she is uninterested in possessing large, bulky arms. Chun Li demands respect with humiliating face slaps or brutal face punches from her glow fist with the ability of knocking out even the greenest of challengers. And if that doesn't work, she'll throw you to the floor. Chun Li is a wall jumper. Chun Li takes constant deep breaths to maintain excellent oxygen flow. Chun Li fights in Taiping Road, an action-packed market filled with bloodthirsty patrons that fail to pay attention to their own activity. The cyclist disobeys biking law. The nearsighted cyclist disobeys even more. And the same chicken has been choked for ages. The meat is old. Chun Li initially came to this location to investigate a M. Bison drug route, but instead ended up kicking ass. Chun Li is not above gloating over unconscious adversaries. She will cheer, giggle, and exclaim, I did it, in Japanese, while her rival bleeds internally, writhing in anguish and confused about her true nationality. Then, after gathering their missing teeth and shifting their dislocated bones, she brags to them, I'm the strongest woman in the world, right in their misshapen face. Truly, humility is not a skill Chun Li has learned. Who cares? It's all about busting those drugs and revenge for Pappy. When she does finally meet and then defeat the wretched crack dealer named M. Bison, she returns to her father's graveyard to explain her successful mission. And almost instantaneously, she strips off her kung fu police dress, throws on some makeup, and goes out to find some cute boys. Quest with me. Learn with us. Enrich your mind. Empower your anchor like our material. Subscribe to our page. Put character into quest. Return every Monday for more. A question of character.